Hello. We're going to do a video today on meditation as a part of self-care. But first let's talk about self-care. We take care of so many people, problems. We have jobs, children, grandchildren, friends that need us, spouses that need our care, children that need our care. But we need to remember to put the oxygen mask on us first. Find a time each day that becomes regular routine for you, especially for self-care. Today we're going to talk about meditation, but there's also other ways of self-care and we'll do that on other videos. Self-care can include a good support system, talking with trusted companions, having healthy outlets, time spent in nature, good nutrition and exercise, journaling, and meditation. So meditation is self-care. It helps to reduce stress and anxiety. It can promote a sense of well-being and balance restore and renew our spiritual life, deepen our relationships, and create more self-awareness. So every day, the same time every day, create a sacred space for you where you can go and be quiet and still. Set just five minutes aside if that's all you have. But if you have 10 or 15 minutes, do that instead. Make it part of your routine, as I said, and rather than rely on self-discipline. Integrate into your practice what best fits your personality, your spirituality or faith tradition. Use music movement or silence, creativity, reflection. Remember to breathe because every minute of every day of every second our breath is what we take with us and our breath is what helps our heart to pump and our heart is what sends the blood to all our organs with the oxygen from each breath. So be conscious of your breath. Hear your breath. Don't hold your breath. And when things bother you or you're getting upset, stop and breathe. Be aware of your breath. And the more you put yourself in the zone of where your breath is, the more you'll be peaceful and be able to deal with situations around you. Today we're going to talk about a way to meditate. You don't have to be in nature to meditate. Just find a comfortable chair, a place on the floor with a pillow against the couch. You could be lying on your bed. You can get so good with meditation you could do it on a subway train. But let's get good at meditating in a space that is quiet. So first find that place and bring your awareness to your breath and begin to slow your breath down, making your exhale longer than your inhale. Breathe in and exhale. Breathe in and exhale. Again, make your exhale longer than your inhale. Use your breath to center yourself and to help you stay in the present moment. As thoughts come and go as they inevitably do, let them float by like big pluff, fluffy white clouds in the sky, gently returning to your breath as often as you need to. 
An inspirational word or phrase can also be used as a focus of attention. This is a time to allow yourself to simply be and not do. This is a gift you give yourself and in turn give others. If we are able to be more aware, more present to ourselves, then we are able to be more present for others who need us, offering more compassion and love and understanding to ourselves and to others. So again, remember to breathe. Pay attention to your breaths. Let yourself drift into a place of peace wherever you are. And remember, you can't take care of anyone else unless you take care of yourself first. Whatever that is that you need to do. We will continue to do other self-care videos where I show you where I go for peace and self-care and I want to share them with you because the more we do this for ourselves the more the world will be a better place we'll have more to give to everyone that we touch and we come in contact with so from Nancy the NP here on caregiver success joining me Join me for more of these videos and I'll take you through my life of self-care. Please give me comments. Be a part of the videos and part of my community. See you soon from Nancy the NP. God bless.